What's going on, guys? Welcome back to No Quip Sports with myself, Joshua Glidden. Uh, awesome show today. A lot of news, most specifically, and probably mostly what I'm going to talk about today is Claude Julien getting fired from the Boston Bruins. It's huge. It's huge. It's humongous. Um, it's it's insane news. Um, Neely and Sweeney releasing the news early Tuesday morning. Uh, many considering it a extremely gutless and uh, cowardly move, um, using the Patriots parade as kind of a smokescreen, um, so as not to draw too much attention to themselves. Uh, I I kind of agree with that. Um, especially Neely was on a on a radio interview yesterday. And he just sounded, oh, well, you know, we, we had to do it for this. Oh, Cam Neely. You know, it just, they did not sound very confident in their reasons. And they just, and Cam Neely wasn't even at the press re- at the press conference. It was just Don Sweeney, who's the GM of the team, obviously. And Cam Neely's reason for not being there is he's the president. You know, it's Neely, it's uh, Sweeney's decision, decision, not mine. And to that I say, man up. You're the, you're, be there. But... Either way, uh, Claude Julien is gone, and for that fact alone, I am relatively pleased. Um, Obviously, we won the Stanley Cup in 2011. Sorry, we. I won't be objective here. The Bruins won the Stanley Cup in 2011, made another appearance in 2013, but since then, they haven't done too hot, and two years in a row, they collapsed down the stretch uh, to fail to make the playoffs, and they're looking at a third year of doing that right now. So they haven't really been too, too hot. Um, they haven't really been doing too well. Uh, they have a win <laughs> right now under the interim. Uh, Bruce, uh, I'm having a brain fart on his name right now, but I'll find it in a second. Uh, <laughs> but they have a win over the Sharks last night. 6-3, to three, Bruce Cassidy. Thank you, Doy. Um Bruce Cassidy has a win as the team's interim head coach, 6-3 over the Sharks last night. Uh, Pasta with some goals, Bergeron with some uh, a blue goal and a few assists. So, uh, good night. They didn't really play too, too great, and they definitely looked kind of all over the place, but, you know, a win under a new coach is a win. But Claude Julien, he will find a job, if not very quickly, quickly. I mean, he's a good hockey coach. Um, He is going to have a job very, very, very soon. Um, So he shouldn't be worried about that. I'm wondering if maybe he's going to hold out for the night. I mean, it's possible. I don't think it'll... I don't think... I don't think he'll wait till next season to get a job. I mean, he may, and that definitely is a possibility that he will hold out to become coach of the Las Vegas Golden Knights, and I think that'd be really cool. Um, But we will see what happens. Um, I don't know how long Bruce Cassidy is going to be coach. Um, I def- there's definitely some prospects out there, but I mean, I'm not gonna, I'm I'm not gonna even go much as far as to guess. I really don't know who is going to be the next Bruins head coach. I think Bruce Cassidy will be it for probably about a month or so, because especially this or- Bruins organization wants to get uh, a long term coach, especially because Julian's had you know Julian had over 700 wins with the team so he's been with the he's been with the Bruins a long while so they're going to want to find a coach that's going to be with the team for the long haul and hopefully brings about some change to the organization but at the same time I definitely feel like more change needs to come with Sweeney being removed as GM and potentially Neely being removed as president because the front office is just as much to blame They throw blame at everybody else but themselves. They think they're perfect, and they just don't think they can do no... no, They don't think they can do no wrong. (laughs) So uh, I can't speak today. I apologize. So I just think, overall, I'm glad Julian is gone. He was a great coach, and I thank him as for myself as a Bruins fan. But that being said, uh, we definitely needed some change, and I am glad it came, but at the same time, the Bruins need more change. Uh, however that may be. So that is definitely the biggest news of the week, uh, Claude Julien. 
um, getting fired from the Bruins, it hit me like a ton of bricks. I was not expecting it personally. I was still on the high of, oh my gosh, the Patriots won the Super Bowl, and then I hear Claude Julien got fired. I was like, say what? So, oh my goodness gracious. Um, so that's the biggest news today. I will be back with a video on Monday. Um, and until next time, go hockey. See you guys.